Welcome to Karting at Game Over. You're in for a great day. These are a high speed, high sensation, real go-kart on a real racetrack. It's a lot of fun. But go-karting is a non-contact sport and there's a couple of essential rules that you'll need to follow today. If you accidentally or intentionally hit another go-kart or a barrier, your cart will be slowed down. After three warnings, you will be removed from the track. Once you're in your cart, to make yourself nice and safe and comfortable, just poke your arms through the seat belts, click them together around the waist, and just tighten the waist straps first before you pull down on your shoulder tabs. To make the go-kart go, you have the accelerator on your right hand foot down here. On the left is your brake pedal. It makes it stop which must be used, especially when going down the ramp and around corners. Now you cannot push both pedals down at once. If you do, the cart will stop. Both feet must be completely removed before placing your foot back on the accelerator to go again. Now to be a safe driver and more importantly, a fast driver, ensure that you keep both hands on the steering wheel at all times. Unless unfortunately you need the reverse function, which is just on your dash. So take your feet off the pedals, hold down the reverse function, then push the accelerator and back you go. To make it go again, all you need to do is take your feet off the accelerator, let go of the reverse button and put your foot back on the pedal to go forward. Once you're in your go-kart, the staff will tell you when you can go out onto the track and they will control the speed of your go-kart until you're safely going around the circuit. While you're having a great time out on the track, make sure you're aware of the carts in front of you and be prepared to stop if they stop or spin out. Particular care is to be taken coming down the ramp. Brakes must be used there. Once your race is over, your cart will be slowed down and all you need to do is just make your way back to the pit lane. Just follow staff instructions and approach safely and slowly. Now that we're done with all the safety stuff, all you need to do is grab yourself a hairnet, find a helmet that's roughly about the right size, extra large, probably not, maybe a medium. Make sure it's comfortable and it fits. Do up the chin strap. Now you need to see which go-kart you're in. Look for your name and the corresponding go-kart number and you are good to go. Now I know that might sound like a lot to take in, but really it's not that hard. You're gonna have a lot of fun. Really all you need to do is just listen to staff instructions. Now it's all about the fastest lap. So having a gap between you and the other carts works to your advantage. Stay safe, be safe, enjoy yourself, and you'll have an awesome time here at Game Over.